measuring adalimumab and infliximab thrush levels from finger prick blood with a rapid point of care assay. Patients suffering from inflammatory bowel disease can be treated with the biologics adalimumab or infliximab. Previous studies demonstrated the usefulness of therapeutic drug monitoring with rapid assays to adjust individually the patient's biologic concentration. A hindrance for true point of care use of these assays is their dependency on serum as analyte matrix, because serum preparation from whole blood is time intensive and requires laboratory equipment. The goal of this project was to design two lateral flow assay kits for the analysis of adalimumab and infliximab in capillary and EDT whole blood specimen, but enables true point of care use. A blood sampling procedure was developed with disposable capillaries that are used for the transfer of finger prick or venous whole blood into dropper bottles that are pre-filled with chase buffer. To measure adalimumab or infliximab levels with a quantum blue reader, the mixture is then applied on a point of care lateral flow test cassette. This procedure is shown in figure 1. In a matrix agreement study, spiked ETT whole blood, whole blood without anticoagulant and capillary blood samples showed good comparability to spiked serum samples used as reference shown in table 1 and table 2. Both point of care assays revealed a bias of less than 15% at the clinical decision points. Linearity is given over a meshing range of 1.3 to 35 micrograms per milliliter for the adalimumab assay and 0.4 to 20 microgram per milliliter for the infliximab assay. Within run precision for the adalimumab assay was between 8 to 22 percent and for the infliximab assay between 7 to 23 percent. Dilutions of capillary and ETT whole blood samples in chase buffer are stable for at least 20 minutes, confirmed by robustness experiments, what allows a certain flexibility at the clinician's site. In conclusion, two point-of-care assays for the determination of adalimumab or infliximab in capillary blood or venous whole blood samples were successfully developed and can be used by non-laboratory professionals with time to result of only 15 minutes and without the need for additional laboratory equipment. The excellent agreement to serum thruff levels shows that the percent of quantum blue point-of-care assays and the point-of-care blood sampling procedure are ideal for adalimumab and infliximab therapeutic drug monitoring analysis at the patient's site in a clinician's office or an infusion center.